Welcome to the Good Enough Garage. On today's episode, we're doing something a little bit different. We're going to be hopping in the White Wall Special and taking a ride out to Aaron's house. You guys have seen him in previous episodes. To pick up his 1960 Chevy wagon. Wants me to upgrade the steering on it for him. And we're going to be trading some work because I'm going to be upgrading that steering for him. And he's going to be fitting the valve covers to the engine on this thing. He's going to be making up those adapters because we got the final valve covers in and they're made out of aluminum. And then we'll save that for a future episode on explaining everything I went through to go from a dream to a reality. One other thing, we're gonna be stopping over at Gloss Labs and picking up Mike on the way. So what do you say we hop in the White Wall Special and head over to Gloss Labs? Okay guys, so it's pretty dark. I don't know if you can actually see me. Well, it's nighttime, but we're at Gloss Labs. Let's go inside and get Mike. Oh, hey, it's Zach. Hi, Zach. What's going on? <laughs> Where's Mike? <laughs> You better not be shitting in there. <laughs> so what's going on, man? What kind of car you got? Oh, that's not very. That's not very fun and exciting. It's <laughs> challenging. Oh, well, there's that. Front quarter windows on it. Oh, nice. The gaskets are so tight. Oh, yeah. You've got about this much film to get behind a solid gasket. So, oh, yeah. you got to loosen it all up and really get it clean. And awesome. So. Hell, yeah. I'll be coming to get that truck soon. So, okay. yeah. Get it out of your hair. Is it leaking all over your uh, garage? No, I put a boxer engine in it for you, though. Did you? Oh, I'm sorry. I misworded that. I put a cardboard box in the engine bay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> now I got a hold of an engine for it. Um, small block Chevy, radiator to drive to, to rear axle, everything. Oh, nice. Running, complete dropout. So I'm pretty pumped about yeah. it. Yeah. So it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. Oh, there he is. Hey. Hey, Mike. Don't go in there. Okay. <laughs> you ready to go? Yeah. Let's get this happening. All here. right. Everything's been picked up. Just saw the suburban we had in here the past couple of days. Yeah. 2004. You get under it, the muffler isn't even, there's no rust on it. The fasteners, you could still all see silver on it, the exhaust hangers. What year was it? 2004. What? California. Yeah. Oh my Green. God. Not a lick of rust on this thing. Wow. So. That's pretty dope. Yeah. They named it Keith. It's a good name for a car. It is. Keith. Good customer. Keith the Suburban. All right. Anyway, let's get going. Hey good seeing you, man. Hey, too. Yeah. Suburban, boy. All right. Bye, Zach. Yeah. Have, fu have fun. Yeah. Oh. Check P it out. Push. Did you see my toaster? Your truck? Your the Oh, the Subaru. Yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. that thing booty? The, the Subaru. I need to have to hit it again. Oh, day. There we go. All right. All right. So, I, yeah, just just watch out for the valve covers there. Okay. If you want, we can throw them behind the seat. I'll just sit them on my backpack. Okay. All right. My goodness. My goodness. Man, I haven't ridden in this truck in... It's been a minute, right? When's the last time I took a ride in this truck? It's probably been 15 years. It's been a minute. It's been a long time. Oh so, my God. it's dark. You probably can't see either of us, but we're going to head over to Aaron's. It's about a 40-minute drive, and we're going to pick up his 60 Chevy wagon so see you guys in a bit there he is. the hell's going on in here what's happening what's happening I'm glad it's not clean <laughs> well, no, you get a vaccination oh no that's my uh <laughs> that's my medium pumpkin nice sticker I like it because I'm a me you fucking think. number 13. I'm a medium pumpkin. All right. by 13. That's the drag link. All right. Center shit. 
Okay. Rag joint. Rag joint. All right. These are your lines. Are you filming? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, lines. What the fuck this is? We'll open this bitch up. Are the lines all cut and everything's already done they to fit? They better be for what I paid for them. <laughs> all right. That's a Pitman arm. Pitman arm, okay. Comes with a new steering box, I take it? Fucking brand new steering box. Right here. That's the money right there. Oh, fuck yeah. Here she is, steering box. What the fuck is this thing? I don't think I've ever seen oh, a that's steering a box that don't that's leak. A, that's a valve. Okay, all right. Valve. Whatever the fuck that this is plastic bullshit. Okay. Alright, uh, drag link. It's everything. Oh, it's Whatever's sweet. in here. I don't in here. I haven't looked at any of this shit. <laughs> oh, this is the um, idler arm. Idler arm. Yeah. Okay. So what what's it replacing under the car? It's a little garbage cylinder. With the with the valve and the shock and all that shit? Power assist? Power assist. Okay. You know what really bugs me about this car, Mike? Is it engine bay? It's freaking gross. I know a guy. I shit my pants at work today. You pooped your pants at work today? Oh, that. Listen to this. This could have been in a fucking movie. <laughs> so, like, I, I go to work early. Earlier than anybody. Everyone poops their pants. If they don't, they're lying. I'm in there. I'm pinstriping. And I'm finishing this last piece. And I got, like, two more lines to go. I don't want to go take a shit. Because my paint's going to dry out my brush. And I'll have to... You know, repallet it and all that bullshit. I don't want to deal with it. So I'm like, you know what? I gotta go real bad. But I'm gonna put these last two lines down. Uh oh. And I put these lines down, and I thought I had to fart, and I fucking sharded like a motherfucker. <laughs> That's the problem. And I'm like, son of a bitch. You just tried to squeeze a little one out. But I'm like, was... I'm like, this isn't that bad. <laughs> this isn't as bad as I thought it was. So I'm like, all right, fuck it. I don't care. I sharded. Fuck it. I put these last two lines down. <laughs> I didn't even get the job done. Did you do it again? No. Oh. <laughs> I put the fucking brush in my clothespin, put it in my reducer, and I start walking and I feel it. And I'm like, oh, I better go to a closer fucking bathroom. <laughs> so I fucking sit down on the chitter and like, I always carry a pocket knife. I sit down on the chitter. Just cut your fucking underwear. <laughs> I sit down on the shitter and I'm like looking at my underwear. I fucking fucking GT racing stripe with those motherfuckers. Yeah, baby, brown and slip. I'm like, well, fuck. There's other people in here. I don't want them to think to see me getting naked in here. Like, what's that motherfucker doing? I'm like, I'm cutting these fucking underwear off. I'm fucking oh my my pocket knife and cut these motherfuckers off, <laughs> ball them up. Oh man. Ball them up, flush them down Take the toilet. Shit, wipe my ass hit the fucking road, dude. <laughs> Get the fuck out of there. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> as long as you, you know, kudos on you for not flushing them. Yeah. <laughs> all right. This is it, man. The filthy wagon. That's cool, it's man. Got porcelain fucking tile dust all over it. All right. It's a good one fucking car. I shouldn't say that, but it really is. Yeah, it's gonna fucking blow up on the way home. Thanks yeah. a lot. Hey, it'll be all right. Oh, if you're gonna go out, you're gonna go out in style. Oh, headlights, headlights, headlights. Oh yeah, look at that. Lighten up, lighten up the other garage. Jeez, you can do surgery with these headlights. Oh. Those Dakota digital gauges? Yeah. We got Aaron 60 Chevy wagon. I didn't do too much video because it's been really dark, but we're at the gas station. Check this thing out. Sweet looking car. So of course, Aaron gave it to me with no gas in it. Mike's inside paying right now. Takes diesel, right? We're gonna put diesel in it. We're gonna get back on the road and head back home. So we'll see you guys at home. So we made it back to the garage. Just gotta shut the big door. This thing like barely fits in the garage, but it's in here. So that's gonna do it for this episode. This was just the go get it episode. So. In the next episode, we're going to work on getting this thing jacked up and starting on the steering for them and get that all squared away. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time on White Wall Steve's Good Enough Garage. Good enough.